I wake up at 5 a.m. I immediately start the day with a morning run. All right, I'm joking. I don't wake up this early and I don't start the day with a morning run. Every morning I try to wake up around 7 a.m. But to be honest, I'm not very good at it. I used to hit snooze a lot, but for the past few weeks I've been using a wake up light. Now this cool device makes it feel like a sunrise in my bedroom by slowly getting brighter. And to be honest, it works pretty well. It makes waking up much easier. So by 7 a.m. I jump out of bed. Take a piss. Head to the bathroom, splash some water in my face and then I brew myself a fresh cup of coffee. Now I know this is not the smartest decision. Experts say that you shouldn't drink coffee right when you wake up. It's better to wait like one and a half to two hours. But screw that, I love this stuff. Now in the warmer months I like to enjoy my coffee on my balcony but since it's winter and way too chilly I drink my coffee in the living room and catch up on some YouTube videos. After that I change clothes and try to give my hair a little start. I take my second coffee and get my first glass of water. I like my water warm, maybe this is strange but hey. I like it. Then I go to my home office. And it's finally time to shine. I turn on some lo-fi beats and start coding. I like to do this first thing in the morning because then I feel the most alert and focused. Usually I keep coding until 10 a.m. because then the daily stand-up with the team starts. Now during the stand-up each team member quickly reports on their work progress, any challenges they are facing and their plans for the day. After the daily stand-up I grab my third coffee and have a small break. And then we have a meeting with the whole development team to discuss the user stories we are going to work on. After the meeting I continue coding again until it is time for the most enjoyable part of the day, my lunch break. I start my lunch break with the Wim Hof breathing technique. I do this together with my cat James. In short, it works like this. I take 30 rapid and continuous deep breaths with no pauses. After the 30 breaths, I take one deep breath in and I exhale completely, like this. And let go. Then I hold my breath for one minute. All right, one minute breath hold from now on. Be in this moment. After the one minute breath hold, I take one deep breath in, hold it for 15 seconds. Take a deep breath in and hold for 15 seconds. And I exhale completely. Let it go. Now I repeat this cycle one more time, but then I hold my breath a bit longer. And after that, I feel freaking amazing. Next, I prepare my meal, which consists of oatmeal with banana, apple, walnuts and for the past few weeks I have also added creatine to it. This supplement is beneficial for my workouts and it turns out that it also has a positive influence on the mind. I mix it all up and then it looks like this. Now note that this is my first meal of the day. I practice intermittent fasting and it definitely improves my focus in the morning. During lunch, I like to watch YouTube or do some other personal related stuff. After lunch, I pick up work again. Now, usually the day is filled with some coding, code reviews and some discussions with teammates. Yo, <laughs> take two. And then around six, it's time to hit the gym. Now I always start with a warm up to get the blood flowing. Today was more or less upper body day, so I trade my chest but also my back. The workout of today basically looked like this. 
I started with a chest exercise and immediately followed it up with a back exercise. Had some rest in between. And then do the same stuff again. Basically, the best day of my life. Oh yeah, and making these shots in the gym was pretty awkward. But hey, I do everything for the views. After the gym, I take a quick shower and then it's time for dinner. Today's dinner was pasta. After dinner, I usually work on my YouTube channel. Now, this can be things like writing a new script, editing a video, or researching a new topic. After a work day, I prefer doing this on the couch because it simply feels a bit more relaxing to me. Now, depending on my mood and energy levels, I usually do this for one to two hours. Then I like to wind down a bit. Today I spend the evening watching a great series. It's the perfect way for me to relax and recharge after a busy day. As the night grew later, it was time to get some rest. I try to read daily for 20 to 30 minutes. Not only does reading enrich my knowledge, but it also inspires me for my YouTube content. Next to this, reading in the evening also makes me a bit sleepy, which is exactly what I need before bed. With a sleepy mind, I turn off my UV lights and I try to fall asleep. And that was it, a day in the life of me as a software developer.